Dawn of Fire is back, baby. Today we have our new quad in game. Oh, I thought the loading screen would have changed. So I've downloaded the files ready inside of the game. So I think we should be all set now to go ahead and discover them. I think it's based on Pong Ping. This quad elemental that we are going to be discovering today. Pong Ping is the mysterious quad that was supposed to be released on Water Island back in the day. Water Island, with all of his concepts, we had Pong Ping. Ah! Oh! Oh my goodness, he's on the continent in Cave Island as well and also Amber Island today But we'll be checking that out ASAP after this We have to check it out in Dawn of Fire first as Dawn of Fire is where it all started So you've got to reel it all back in, haven't you guys? Where's Pong Ping here? Oh, there they are. So Leaf, Earth, Cold and Fire. I should know this by heart to be honest now guys I mean, I've made a hundred videos predicting this thing. <laughs> where are you? I can't <laughs> I'm too excited. Dawn of Fire has not been updated in so long. What a cold fire and then air, eh, right? Have we got it? We're breeding Krillby instead, no! Contain yourself, MPG, otherwise we're not gonna be able to read this thing. <laughs> I remember how I used to do it back in the day. I used to go up and low when monsters actually did release in Dawn of Fire. Well, I suppose they're releasing now at least. <laughs> Oh my god, there's gonna be even more to discover as we keep getting more. That's gonna be so epic. The Repetillo and Mammoth. Oh, we made it first try as well. <laughs> Pumping. That's so cool. Look at that egg. What kind of sound is it gonna make? If they are in Vicinarus's verse, I'm gonna be so excited about that. Look at them. They're adorable. Look at this. We finally have a new monster. Move out of the way. Stop around here. We're not in Vicinarus's verse. <laughs> Wait, let's check out what his sleep's like. Oh, that's so cute! Now wake up before I sing, because I'm worried he's gonna sing. <laughs> his ear looks so weird. We should probably feed it up, otherwise we're not gonna be able to see a thing. Don't worry, I definitely have a lot of food for your ping pong. Pong ping, even. <laughs> From all the years where we've been waiting for you. Don't worry, I have plenty of food. We don't need to worry about that. What kind of sound do you make, then? Because I know Monster Handler Michael was supposed to have voiced you or something. <laughs> You can really see how they went full in in this experimentation and making this noise. So cool! Understand, Michael, I like what we have going on here. I really like you. As time's come though now, guys, we've got to feed this thing up. And you know what monsters like the most, right? They like to eat strollers. So I will give you plenty of strollers. Ping pong, pong ping. I will get the name right eventually. Look at that, 77 clockwork monkeys. Well, we definitely don't have to worry about this on this department, but I tell you what, I'm gonna feed you everything else so I can clear my storage a little bit, shall we? Mushroom pizza to go. Yes, please. Some noodles with that too. Maybe that's enough for you. Gotta update the screen, Dawn of Fire, otherwise I can't see why I'm going with this. Are you really gonna do this to me? You're gonna eat all of my resources I've been saving up for like the past year. Longer than that, since I've even had to teleport anything. Not using that. Stop that. Oh, I guess you'll have to. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Cave Island as well. I can't remember the last time that was updated. That's probably my cue to say, oh, that's not been updated in a while. But honestly, I can't remember. Bicinerus went there not too long ago. Oh, here we go. We're gonna see what it looks like now. That's so goofy. Look at it. <laughs> Is it playing throughout the entire thing then? Move out of the way, Krill base. Cave Island's that loud. I'm struggling to hear this thing. It's so goofy though. And the idle animation. Okay, let's put you to sleep. <laughs> the vibrations. Hold up here though, guys. I've just got to say, what is this thing going to look like in the original game? I'm pretty excited to find out. Wait, we've got to read more about this thing though. When it comes to athletic training regimens, the season Pong Ping spares no expense devouring only the most health conscious and sensible snacks at breakneck speeds, mind you, and tirelessly whips whopping with any monster foolish enough to challenge it to a game of table tennis. When opponents are scarce, the Pong Ping is a master of self directed play and will happily exercise at its musical muscles to keep its cheeks limber. Oh, look at that sleeping animation as well. Wait, this is the monster from the loading screen? It was not Red Rome. <laughs> I was not expecting that. 
that. The legs matched up and everything. I'm not gonna lie, this is way better than that though. Sorry, Red Rump, but I mean, this is so much better. Finally, the final quad theme here. I'm really in love what we have going on here too. It's so phenomenal and exciting for Dawn of Fire's future. We're finally gonna be seeing what is gonna be happening with Dawn of Fire. I mean, we have all of these quints left now, which are gonna be coming to Amber Island, and I have no doubt they're gonna be making their way over, so. Just saying Dawn of Fire's got a pretty bright future ahead of it now. So exciting. Let's read about its baby form. The rookie Pongping is more of an enthusiast than an athlete, using the special paddles it totes around to bat playfully at its inflatable cheeks. However, practice makes perfect, and with the right training and an attitude, this spunky monsterling might one day harness the fire down below to achieve sports stardom. I've got to see, are we still at Christmas though? I'm not still on the Christmas load. Screen. We're still on the Christmas loading screen. Are we for real right now? We have Pong Ping in game, Big Blue Bubble. What is going on with the loading screen for Dawn of Fire? It's June. I'm wearing my summer outfit right now. It's crazy how that's still the loading screen. <laughs> to think of it, I don't think we've actually had a sports theme monster before. I just think that's a really unique element behind this monster. So I think that element is really cool too. And just how they've tied it together with its sound. I think it deserves a bit of appreciation in that fight because the sound actually does tie to this monster's law. Yes, guys, by the way, yes, I am being a bit greedy and trying to breathe this baby form again. Who can blame me? I have a year's worth of diamonds at my ready disposal and I just want this thing on both islands. I think I'm going to have to listen to its cave island counterpart again though to really get the gist of what exactly contributes towards the song as whilst I did hear its contribution, it's a bit foggy as I couldn't really hear it inside of that. I think it's because of all the prismatics I've laid down. I think it's a very minor addition, isn't it, that hearing that again? It's very minor additions to the continent and cave island parts. Again, it just kind of does cave island and then the continent even really need that much of a momentum boost. No, not really. So honestly, I think it's a really cool sound. This probably is the final monster on cave island. Can we just bear that in mind for a minute here? This likely is our last monster because they have the Space Island final verse to fill in and Cloud Island probably could use something else. Maybe Party Island. Party Island could definitely use something. Perhaps a lot more mentors on that island. So there's a lot going on. The Quints are likely to deliver a lot more. So I do actually think that our three remaining Quints are quite likely to go on the other island. So yeah. Oh no, wait, there's three other outer islands. So this is probably the last time Cave Island is getting updated as well. Oh no. <laughs> Cave Island is definitely my least favorite out of Dawn of Fire though, so. I'm sorry, Cave Island. It's not a bad island, it's just my least favourite. You gotta say what your favourites are, right, guys? Given its small part, I think it contributes a relative amount, given what it can. And I think that's what counts and I wouldn't have expected any more. That's so cool. You guys might have noticed that our setup is a little different today. I'm in a nice hotel and I am actually traveling. So throughout June, you can expect me to be recording through this camera. So that's why the quality might look a little different. I cannot wait to check this thing out on Amber Island. I'm excited to see what it does on Amber Island and how it contributes, especially seeing its sound inside of Dawn of Fire now. I think it contributes quite a bit, not specifically to the continent, but the continent is that jam packed. You can't expect it to have a groundbreaking sound every single time. And I'm in love with that design. They've done it with this one. Pop notch update. Give me the quints. I'm ready. Definitely let me know what you think about Pong Ping down below and make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed and to subscribe down below too guys. I'll see you guys later though for now. Happy Dawn of Fire in. Dawn of Fire updates. I'm back baby. See you later though guys. Bye.